I was brought up with comics. My dad was a comics fan, so there were always lots of comics in the household. But I know when he was growing up, it was different. And a lot of parents, teachers, and even writers and intellectuals thought comics were an assault on civilization. In the 40s and 50s, a moral panic about comics swept the Western world. And in New Zealand, Parliament banned a whole lot of them. There was also an American book called Seduction of the Innocent that fanned the flames. One day my grandfather found my dad's collection of comics and burnt the whole lot in the back garden. Of course, these days when you look at something like Sheena, Queen of the Jungle, it looks kind of tame by today's standards. I bought a, another, one of my favourite comics, uh, an Australian printed Buck Rogers, which were hard to get. Everything was hard to get in those war years. And my friend and I on the desk reading this Buck Rogers which was a change from reading my trash. Next thing we see a shadow, and a big arm come down and says, you are forbidden to read comics. You know, these are trash. And he went up to the front of the class and to the horror of all those devilish little boys sitting in there, he ripped this comic in bits. Now, I'll tell you what, that comic today would be worth about $500, $600. Naughty teacher. <laughs>